I don't think it's an exaggeration to say that HBS made me into the person that I am today. So this is a very innovative healthcare story. This is not about technology. This is not about apps. And there isn't a day where I'm not using something that I learned from operations, from the entrepreneurial manager. I mean, the, those courses ended up being the foundation of how I think about the work that I do every day. And this is a school that talks a lot about transformation. So after two years of being here, you're a different person. You think differently. So how do we think about innovating in primary care? It was the combination of the case method as well as the intellect of the classmates and the faculty here that really pushed my critical thinking to another level. The case is about Caremore's big strategic question, which is, as we grow and change as an organization, what populations do we serve? If people are elderly and frail, and it sounds like have chronic, lots of chronic diseases. What I'm seeing from models like Caremore and others is that Medicare and Medicaid could really be laboratories for incredible innovation that could translate into improvements in the private sector as well. Here we're trying to put the two together. I think the big difference at Caremore is our culture. Lots of organizations talk about having a culture of caring. We're an organization that has figured out how to operationalize a great culture. So Caremore is a, an organization that operates in eight states with revenues of $1.4 billion and takes care of over 130,000 patients. And that marriage of kind of payer and provider creates this opportunity for us to think really differently about our patients and what we can do for them. The Caremore model that Sachin has now been integral in developing reflects a lot of the ideas that he developed here at HBS and in his time as a physician here in the Boston community. You know, I was the only person in my class at Harvard Medical School who went to business school here, and it was a very exciting time to be here. When Sachin Jain was an MBA student here, he worked with my colleague Michael Porter on the development of ideas around value-based healthcare delivery. I was jointly employed as a resident at the Brigham Women's Hospital and then faculty here at HBS. And that ended when I was asked to go to the Obama administration and work on the implementation of the Affordable Care Act. When I think about my aging parents, when I think about all the patients that we take care of at Caremore, the things that are gonna make a difference are people actually caring in their everyday lives. The fact that it's easier to frankly think about scaling business models that involve technology than it is to scale business models involving people. Not a new app, not a new tech solution, and we have so lost that right now. I think they become really interesting models for people who want to try to innovate much more broadly. I've been really lucky to have HBS graduates join us at Caremore because I know the rigor with which they think through clinical problems. I think that the role of organizations like HBS is to train a next generation of leaders who aren't satisfied with incrementalism. And frankly, when they see others pursuing revolutionary change, we stand behind them, not hold them back.